Hello everyone and welcome back to Ash Plays. I'm Ash. Welcome back to the Sky Factory. It's been a minute, but we're back. And today, we're going to be working on crafting an iron seed and maybe some other stuff. Uh, basically the mystical agriculture stuff. We're going to be working on that today. I have the some of the stuff that we need based just basically from accumulating over time from our farm. Because we do, you may forget because we don't really talk about it too much, but... We have an Infernium Essence farm with a few other tid uh, tidbits over here that I intermittently manage by coming over here and clicking this boy. Um, and then we've been accumulating more of the Essence and put just putting it over here, basically. Uh, so we have a lot, actually. We have quite a lot. So I can just take a row of that. And that's not all... We have also got a lot over in the chests, in the barrels or the drawers, rather. And I think we're going to have enough to at least get some iron seeds going. And that'll be a check off all, off the list. And then there's the next thing is to get diamond seeds. So, um, it just sort of goes off the rails after that. Mystical farming is pretty nuts. Uh, it's like, oh yeah, make an iron seed. Make a diamond seed. Stab something and get a chunk of them. Uh, make a chunk of flesh with a dagger. That's insane. Use growth crystals, etc. So, there's a lot of stuff to do with this, but I think we can get some of them done today. Uh, we'll see. I already made a little bit of the intermedium essence, which is what we're going to need for the... Uh, for the thing. Uh, how the hell do I get this out of there now? It's not letting me grab this let me have my stuff son honestly what's happening I don't get it am I am I missing something how oh wait I'm probably do I'm just I just don't remember how to use these things because it's been so long since I played this <laughs> I'm using the wrong click damn okay so I've got a stack of intermediate essence which is what we need basically to make this we're going to need a tier 3 crafting seed in the middle with some iron around it and then some intermedium essence around that. The tier 3 seed is a tier 2 surrounded by that. A tier 2 is a tier 1 surrounded by this. And then a base crafting seed is a seed surrounded by prosperity ore, which I think we have a little, at least a little bit of somewhere. Here's some right here, actually. Uh, so, yeah. Let's get this... Oh, look. As you can see, this is like... Honestly, I haven't even messed with these in so long that there's just the leftovers of the last time I off-camera messed with this. This is from, like, months ago. Okay. So we got a seed with prosperity stuff around it. And then this goes like this. And then this guy needs that darker green... Um, like, this guy and this guy. We'll get, um, we'll get a stack of each. So, this one into this one into this. So, we'll do this with iron around it. So, it's not so hard to make them. It's just that you have to make, if you want a farm of it, obviously, you need to make a bunch of them. All right, so we need some iron. Uh, let's go grab some out of the computer. Ugh. Okay, sorry if this sounds a little bit low energy. It's because it is a little bit low energy. I'm a little bit out of it today, but I'm trying to, you know, get back on the schedule. I fell off for a little bit when I was feeling under the weather. Now I'm trying to get back into it. So hopefully this comes out okay. Either way, iron seeds will be accomplished by the end of this. Actually, it's about to be accomplished like right now. Kind of overestimated how long this is going to take. Uh, I forgot that we actually have so much Infernium Essence that we can pretty much do whatever the hell we want at this point. So I've got an Iron Seed. That's done. I can go mark that off the book in a second after I plant this thing. Uh, we also have these... I've uh, been planting the Dirt Essence. I don't know, really know why because we have the Dirt Farm now, but, you know, whatever. Uh, we have... The reds, two redstone essences, and I think we have like a tier two somewhere, a tier two normal infernium essence plant over here somewhere. 
So I guess what we'll do is we'll uh, get these boys and we'll just replace we'll just replace a couple of them with some iron seeds. Where the hell did I put it? Where did it go? I just had it in my inventory and now it's gone. And how Oh, it's because this thing is on maybe. Something's happened. I know why they replanted. Where did my seeds go? I just had it in my inventory. I didn't do anything with it, I swear. What the shit? Minecraft, everybody. What the fuck is going on? Maybe I'm missing it. Iron. Nothing in my inventory. What the hell did I do? I don't understand what just happened, but I guess we're going to have to go make another one. I honestly am at a bit of a loss. Um, uh, what the hell are they doing over here, dude? I have no idea what just happened. Okay, we'll plant these here. We'll go back. Uh, you know what? Let's get four of them if we can. Um, so we'll make a four area here, and we'll just plant the four iron seeds. And then we'll start looking into what we need. I'm thinking we probably need the blue ones to make the diamond seeds. Uh, so I should have gotten some more iron out of there while I was there. So we need, I'm going to make four or three more. I need tw nine, twelve, twelve iron. Let's grab 16. And... Might as well grab 16 diamonds while we're here. We're accomplishing goals. That's the main thing in this freaking mod pack. It's easy to look at them and you get up all the easy ones done. And then you're just looking at stuff like kill, like beat Minecraft, basically. It's like, oh man, I don't know about that. I'm not sure if I'm ready for all of this. So we're just sort of tackling mystical agriculture in the intermediate between us and all that nuts shit that it wants us to do. So I've got 12 Supremium Essence as well. Uh, we'll probably need them later. So I need three more of these. Surrounded by Prosperity Ores. Prosperity Shards might actually be our bottleneck if we're not careful. I'm not sure how much we actually have in the computer if we have any. Okay, so this surrounded by this. Wait, we have, oh, it's Inferium. And then this surrounded by this. And then this surrounded by this. Then this boy like this. And then the iron, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, we got three more that'll give us four total. Let's go get, let's go to sleep real quick. And we'll do this, so we'll, we need to check our uh, void ore chest, see how, what, what's done. I haven't really run the, the server very much, maybe like 30 minutes uh, since last time. So the void ore miner's probably in the same state as it was. Which is in a bad state. It's pretty good. Okay, so let's plant this here, this here, and this here. Boom. Got that going. So we got four iron essence seeds. I'd kind of like to plant, uh, maybe replace the dirt essence with two more, these two with two more redstones. Why not? Just to keep it symmetrical. Oh, sorry. And um, I think now we need to look into the diamond seed, obviously. So, uh, diamond. Diamond seeds. Ooh, okay. That's a little bit more than I thought it was going to be. Um, so, Supremium Essence is the one after the blue, so which is Superium Essence. And we're going to need infusion crystals to actually make this happen. 
Uh, I don't remember where mine went. I'm pretty sure I had it over here, but maybe I think I moved it for some reason after that. So maybe it's in our computer. Uh, crystal. Infusion crystal. I don't think I don't. It's not in here, obviously. Right, so we'll just have to make one. It shouldn't be too bad, right? Infusion. Yeah, it's not so bad. What about the other thing? The Master Infusion Crystal. It's an infusion crystal with epic bacon and more premium essence. And another star. So, yeah. No. We're not doing that route, obviously. <laughs> As if. As if. Okay. Oh. Let's uh let's do this. Let's make this dream a reality. So we need a diamond in the middle with some Inferium Essence and some Prosperity Shards. No problem. Probably should have done this over there at the computer. Why didn't I? Who knows? And then it is that guy in the middle with the super Superiums around it. And we need... If we're only going for the one seed, we just need like a little bit of this, I guess. That's not enough. That isn't enough. So we need to make this, I guess, into more of it. Like that. Okay. Well, that's, we did it. So it's diamonds. Oh, we need even more though. We need even more. We need four more of this. Okay. So it was, we're probably gonna need to turn this into some more of that. Actually may have just enough. I don't, I don't really know. So there's four. Yeah, it's not gonna be even close to enough. Okay, we're gonna need a lot more stuff here. We're gonna need a lot more. killing me here you're killing me okay there's that and that's a little bit of this and then this is a little bit of this it's not even gonna be close enough again we're gonna need a ton dude this is like one more supremium worth of stuff so it takes a full stack basically uh, actually ex I think exactly a full stack of inferior essence to get one supremium essence, which is fine. It's symmetrical and mathematically symmetrical. But it is a lot. So maybe all those stacks in the uh, chest over there isn't actually that much in the grand scheme of things. Okay, we got a full stack of that. Now we need to do this. To do this, just to get one more F. Okay, so, oh my god. Actually, that's not even true, even. I think we need, like, four full stacks of Inferium Essence to make one. Because, like, if I make one of these, right? If I make a whole stack of this, Prudentium, you then have to use this full stack... That equals four Inferium stacks, which gives me 16 Intermediums, which gives me four superi Superiums, which gives me one Supremium, which is enough for now we've, we're up to enough to make the seeds we need. Uh, so, I mean, that's something, I guess. Hopefully... Maybe there's a way to use the seed now that we have it to get more. I don't think so, though. Okay, so I've got 
to make crafting seed. Am I doing this wrong? I don't remember. God damn it. Okay. I'm dumb. I just had it there. Okay. So now we need to make the tier one and then so on and so forth. One, two, three, four. Uh, shit. We need to make more of the other stuff now, though. We've used it all. So let me go ahead and do that. Uh, crystal. You know what? Let's just do it. Let's just do it this way. Okay. Uh, crafting. Boom. And then we'll use this remainder to make... Some of this. And then we needed the blue. Crap, dude. This is a lot. This is a lot. Okay, we'll just make as much as we can. We're just going to make two stacks of the dark green because I can't be bothered to say pr pr words like prudentium, you know, I can't be bothered. I'm, I'm past that point in my life. All right. We're going to start making the blue or orange rather. Let's start making the orange. And then we'll make, what the hell am I doing again? The blue. We need to make the blue seeds. Okay, and then the blue goes around this boy. Okay, and then we need to make enough red. Oh, we have enough red now. We made it ahead of time, of course. There's the red seeds. Now we just could do this. Boom, diamond seed accomplished. It was actually a little bit more uh, involved than I assumed it would be. And mostly just in terms of intensity of resources required. But we have it. We've done it. And to what end, really, nothing. It, like, we have a diamond seed and we have iron seeds. But, like, the amount of diamonds iron and iron we're getting from other resources kind of makes it irrelevant, if I'm being honest with you guys. We're going to break these and we're going to put our diamonds in between the two bits. Like, it says that, but it's not true. We're going to let it run, because we actually probably need more. But, like, this is not even going to scratch the surface in retrospect. So, uh, we're probably going to need to be a little bit more conscious about what's happening to our farm. Let's let it figure out what's going on with the seeds here, because sometimes they just disappear and it has to replant them. There you go. Okay, And I think we're okay. Let's turn it off now. Ugh. And honestly, we might be able to do something like have another solar array like that one eventually. That just powers this. Or we can eventually, like I said last time, hook it up to our system, our, net, our reactor and stuff. I just don't trust that it's going to be good enough to power that thing. That thing sucks so much energy, dude. It has to have basically its own generator just to power it and even then if i leave it on for lo too long it's going to just annihilate the power that it is creating for it it's not it's very inefficient like even with efficiency upgrades it's still super super inef inefficient okay so we've got that done a solium dagger i guess the best thing to do here is to just make a solium dagger and then just wing it i'm assuming you got to kill someone with it and that's, it's that simple, but who knows? Use to obtain mob chunks. 
Did they have to name them Mob Chunks? I don't think so, but you know what? It's it's not for me to decide. I'm not the mob the mod maker. I'm just saying that Mob Chunks is the probably one of the worst ways you could word that uh, sort of idea. Okay, do we have any Solium? I know we've made some. We have one. Actually, we have more than one because we have some dust we can cook. Fantastic. Okay, furnace time. We're st of all the stuff we've built, and we still are basically using a vanilla furnace to cook stuff. Um, so that's not how that works. How do I make this stuff? Solium dust into solium dust in pink. Solium dust in pink. It has to be solium dust in pink. Are you shitting on my chest right now? Why? Why do I have the non... I don't get it. All right. We've got to mix this stuff in with some of this stuff, I th guess. It's got to be the prudentium as well, which is just an extra pain directly in my anus. But we're going to get it done. It's no problem. We got this. I think the pro I think the, the basic... I like mystical agriculture. I just think the basic flaw with it is that everything in it is done the exact same way. Like, how do you make solium dust? You mix this stuff with some of this stuff in the same pattern that you would do any basically anything else with. It's just, it's not super ingenuitive between all the crafting recipes and the way you get different tiers of things. It's, I'm just saying it. It's monotonous, if nothing else. Okay, let's let's see how many we can make here. Probably like two, yeah. Well, hopefully that's enough. It is should be. We only need two, and we already have one, so we should only need one more, and we have two. That's math, everybody. That's math. Let's cook this thing now. It's more. It's a mod about the resource grind. Is the problem I think? Because all it really is is about numbers. Numbers that divide into smaller numbers, which divide into smaller numbers, which divide into smaller numbers, which divide into smaller numbers, and just makes it so you need a whole bunch of things to make it uh, happen. Now, the one question we have to ask now is, what is this thing? A mystical tool rod. Are you fucking kidding me? At least it's easy to make. Uh, so, do we have any sticks? We have a stick. Do we have any prosperity ore in here? A little bit. Not... Not a lot. D. We this might be an issue later on. Okay, so we've got this thing. Now we just need to put these to like this and like that specifically apparently. Solium dagger gotten. Great. Okay, so a mob chunk. I'm assuming I can kill any mob that's bad. You know, maybe not a sheep or a pig. So maybe if I was first, I'll sleep. Maybe if we go kill a pigman, a pigman, and get a mob chunk, then we'll have three things done in this episode, which should be huge for us. Really huge. I really only thought we'd get like a couple. The two, like the one seed, was all I really thought I was like shooting for, and then two seeds would be uh, even better. But if we can get a mob chunk, man. The dream will be a, become a reality at that very moment. Right. Where are them boys at? Where are them boys? Come on, baby. Spawn for your daddy. Jesus Christ, sorry. My cat just as I lay down against my cup filled with liquid. Okay, let's uh, stab him. Let's stab him. <laughs> I'm going to stab him. Yes, hello. It's me. I'm going to be stabbing you today. I can see the chunk. I can see the chunk laying on the ground, but I've got to deal with all the brethren first, obviously. Come and get it, son. Oh, my God. He did. He came in. He got it. Okay. And I'm assuming the green thing is a mob chunk. It's a zombie chunk. Specifically. 
Is there an item called a mob chunk? Right, so unfortunately, I lost a little bit of footage there of us being going through a murder spree because I ran out of hard drive space. But we have tier one mob chunks by cooking these. Oh, I don't know what this is actually. An experience chunk. What the fuck is this for? You put four together for a bottle of enchanting. Right, so that's something I'm not really into, to be honest. I don't care about that. Uh, but basically, I had some zombie chunks. I cooked them in a furnace. It gave me some mob chunks. Then came back. And we finished up. In the book. Um, and we took a little bit of a look. Because I don't know what this stuff is for, honestly. What is a mob chunk for? Let me out. Um, if I hit you on this, you can see that it. I can make it back into a zombie chunk. Can I make it into a tier two? And that's pretty much it. I don't actually know what the fuck the point of this is but you know such is life like what's the what's the point of anything really like i can go i can get to go back and forth between zombie chunks and mob chunks to what end i don't really know i'm assuming i can do something with it but at this point it's not super obvious if you know leave a comment below in the in the, in the comments obviously that's where you leave them um that's the end of this episode i got nothing more for you i'm sorry if you like this episode though up against all the odds and you, you like it hit the like button if you're new hit the subscribe button and as always if you want to help the channel grow don't forget to share it and i'll see you guys next time on the sky factory